In order to acquire an image using the non-vitreatic fundus on phone, switch on the device. Ensure that the bat status light switches on without blinking, ensuring that there is sufficient charge on the device. Next, ensure that the iPhone device also has at least 25% charge. Click on the NMFOP Fundus NM Butterfly app located on the screen. A new patient folder may be created by filling in the appropriate details or an existing patient folder may be entered into to acquire new images. Click on the camera icon and enter the image acquisition mode. Please ensure that for non vitreatic imaging, either the lights in the room are switched off so that there is sufficient darkness or use the bellow provided with the device. The Remedio Fundus on Phone ensures high quality non vitreatic retinal imaging is made possible in a reasonably dimly lit room. Ensure that the pupil is located at the center of the live view. In the infrared mode, move into the pupil. Ensure that the pupil is at the center. At the appropriate working distance, by moving the joystick left or right or up and down, you will now see a very clear infrared view of the retina. At this point, ensure that you are able to touch the screen to autofocus. You are now ready to take a shot. Trigger to take a high quality image of the retina. You can then save the image. If you wish to take a very high quality zoom view of the disc, you can zoom the disc, move the disc to the side to ensure that you now are able to see the disc at the center of the screen. Touch once again to autofocus and shoot. Thus, the very low intensity of the flash on the Remedio non vitreatic fundus on phone ensures that you can take multiple images of the same pupil without fearing reduction in size of the pupil due to illumination. The Remedio fundus on phone can take high quality pictures in the midriatic mode. In the midriatic mode, ensure that the toggle switch is switched to the midriatic mode, which is indicated by the presence of a single white lamp. The intensity of the lamp may be varied by using the app slider located on the screen. We now demonstrate how a high quality midriatic image is taken using the fundus on phone. Ensure that the patient is fixated such that the pupil is at the center of the eye and the center of the screen. Next, move in with the joystick. Ensure that a high quality live view is seen on the screen as is the case here. We may also move the disc to the center to ensure that we capture a very high quality image in a midriatic mode. Touch the phone to autofocus. You may also zoom in to see the disc extremely clearly, refocus and you're ready to shoot. This ensures that an extremely high quality picture can be taken in the midriatic mode. You may retake the shot in a larger field by unzooming, going forward with the joystick and now once again taking a 45 degree view of the retina. In case you wish to see details on the macula, you may move the device to the side, focus on the macula, zoom in to be able to see the macular details. Thus, 
a high quality posterior pole image of the retina can be taken in a mediatic mode.